Oh my oh! god! Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Casper Say. How the devil are you, mate? On this beautiful Tuesday. Should have been Monday, but I was like, you know, I was maximum busy, mate. Maximum busy, please! Today we're looking at a video. This video is a scary video. It's a freaky deaky video. The channel was called King Frostmare. Make sure you go to his channel, subscribe, and do that there. And I know it's freaky because the title says the scariest videos you cannot turn off. Ooh. Also, thank you so much for sending me recommendations of other channels. I'm on the hunt at the moment, mate. I'm on the hunt for other, like, compilation channels. All right? So if you've got any suggestions, which you already are sending me them, so thank you so much. But going forward, I want to I find some new... I want to find some new blood. Okay? Anyway, let's get into the video, mate. The scariest videos you cannot turn off. Let's hope. A freaky deaky. Without further ado, da dilly day. Let's do this. Shh. Hello guys, time for scary videos. Today with a creepy shadow encounter in Kent's basement and an eerie CCTV recording which might have captured an apparition. Now let's buckle up and stay frosty. Buckle up and stay frosty. Go on, King Frost, man! In the pub. The following is an interesting clip that has been uploaded by StayRB to the paranormal section of Reddit. The user states that he grew up around his grandparents, who were the owners of a local pub. People always said that this pub was haunted, and some even stated that they saw ghosts in there themselves. Today, RB is sharing a short clip that he could get from the camera of the place. He states, This is a small clip I have on my phone from the pub's camera. It's showing the man who used to follow me in my grandparents' pub. Up. A man that used to f Hey! Oh, oh my fucking hell, mate! You did you did you see that, mate? What the shit, man? What the shit? Is that just a weirdo bastard pissed up on the corner there? Or is that actually a ghost? What the hell? Oh look at him! My grandma always said the pub was haunted, so I'm going with ghost. No one. Mate, that's like one of those like black eyed kids. They're not the black eyed peas, the black eyed kids, mate. One else would have been there at the time in the morning. Mate, you've just got someone locked in from the night before, pissed up. That's what has happened. He's, been, he's had a lock-in, you've forgotten about him, he's pissed up from that night, like, now he's just woken up. Oh, we God, see- Look at his face, mate! What? What you look at his face? He's like Skeletor! He's somebody peeking around the corner here. Pretty creepy, to be honest. Yeah! His family does believe that this was indeed a paranormal encounter. Of course, there's no proof for this claim. Maybe it was just a creepy guy. But why would anybody do this if it wasn't a staged incident? Oh god, it's like he's got no eyes and it's like sunken in. It's like Tales from the Crypt! Of course. Who can say? Oh god. Look at you! Oh mate. Oh, whoa! Basement encounter. Now we want to take a look at one of Kent's recent videos in which he's sharing an event that took place during an investigation by another paranormal team which was visiting the Lamb House to conduct their own little paranormal investigation. The basement is filled with tons of negative energy as I can attest myself and the air always feels thick. One of the female investigators is trying to contact whatever is living down there. Are you guys down here? Ah! Fucking hell, I missed it twice! I missed it! Because I'm looking at you! Look at you! Are you guys down here? Ah! What? No. Something just hit the back of my leg. Are you guys down here? Ah! Oh, mate. Janice thought a rock was thrown at the back of her leg. After carefully looking over the recordings, nothing hit the back of her leg. Nothing landed on the floor behind her. But right before the back of her leg was hit, we see something in the recording that is quite troubling. A skull face with deep dark eye sockets. 
Something seems to have touched her leg, and it almost looks. Oh fucking hell! Yeah, how man? Like, uh, what the hell? How did you see that, mate? Like, like these these people have got different so eyesight. Like, how do they pick this shit out? It's like the magic eye test. Like, just just stare at it, you know, and you, and you go cross-eyed, and you can start. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Do you remember those ones back in the nineties? Just like a big picture full of just mumbo jumbo, and you and you're squinting. Yeah, I can see it! I can see it! Oh, it's gone, I've just blinked. Looks like a face is peeking through the floor here, doesn't it? Is it actually the same shadow entity that was peeking from behind the staircase one day? Mate, that's just a g What the fuck am I looking at here, mate? Look at- Look at you, bald-headed baby bastard! What the f- Mate, that's just a glitch. But that, Shortly I don't know after what that the lady is. had been touched, one of the stationary cameras also captured this. Do something. Touch me. Play with my hair. Okay? That's what she said. <laughs> oh. oh, fuck off! What the shit was that, mate? What the shit was that, mate? That is not- Oh, fucking hell! Oh, God! <laughs> mate, that went supersonic speed. Nothing moves that fast in real life, apart from when I run, because I just fucking Rambo it. <laughs> Times the force I felt. A black shadow is making it into the hole, not to be seen again for the night. There are some who question the validity of these lamb house encounters and underestimate the reality of these spirits. I warn people who come to the lamb house, do not provoke these spirits. When I first started these investigations, I too underestimated what would happen if these spirits were provoked. I I, that, that is one location. These, this, um, what's his name? Uh, you know who it is, right? You know his voice, right? Lives in his house. He's got shit jumping out of his curtains and everything, right? He's bloody brilliant. I would be really worried about investigating in this place. Really, really worried. Like, I've gone to Bodmin Jail, right? That was freaky as shit. We're due to go on another one, which is legit haunted, mate, in the castle, okay? It's this there, man. Like, what he experiences is just, it's just on another level. I learned by my mistakes not to provoke these spirits. And you don't always know what you're dealing with in this basement. This is not the Okay, okay, okay. First time a strange anomaly has been captured in the lamb house. This exact entity has appeared before. Like, people say that's a cat. That ain't no cat. That's a double negative. That isn't a cat. Alright? That is not a cat. That's something else, mate. Oh, man. Again, was it the same thing that had touched her leg? Very creepy indeed. Backyard incident. This video was shared by user Ailey Oops. It was captured by the surveillance camera of a friend, which was overseeing the backyard area. The video was captured in the midst of night, and nobody was around at the time of the recording, apparently. He asks Reddit, can you debunk this? Captured on a friend's surveillance feed. Oh my shit! Holy fuck! He's gone in your bloody house, mate! Who leaves the fucking door open like that in the dead of night? What the shit, man? Now, it's interesting that the store- Oh, it's in your house now? It's in your house now? What are you gonna do? Huh? Crosses ain't gonna do shit, mate. Holy water ain't gonna do shit.
Maybe it will, I don't know, I'm just... Or would be open in the midst of night, with nobody around though, right? But we can clearly see somebody moving outside of the house, before it pops up in the doorframe, and then it retracts. The user believes this to be a ghost, but if that's not the case, was it simply a camera malfunction? It is really weird though, that, that we can see the object outside of the house, I find. Well, I couldn't say for sure what was unfolding here, but it makes me wonder. To oh god, it's like it's got a dress on as well. It's like a stereotypical ghost, mate. It's got a dress. Look how I've paused it. Is that a face? Mate, I'm, I'm making shit up in my head now. To say the least. The ship incident. The following is another CCTV recording, which was captured on a ship which was sailing off the coast of Somalia this past September. Security saw some strange balls of light at first, what? but didn't think anything of it. Nobody was moving in the lower area of the ship at the time for security reasons, as they were making it over the border. The area was pitch black at the time. The area was pitch black, but then something really unusual unfolded. Holy you see hell. a person manifesting, but how is that possible? It looks like a dark oh cloud Oh my is god! And then the person appears. Many of the crew were sure that a mysterious event was transpiring here. Of course, they didn't see anybody leaving the area at that time. It's like it's got no bloody head! Cameras. It's got no head! So, do we have to assume that a ghost was visiting that oh, night? And now it's just disappeared! Oh, that was weird, mate. Abandoned mine. User Oh My God Jazz has shared the next capture to the paranormal Reddit section. My university teacher showed me this photo that was displayed in one of our campus buildings. There is an old mine near our university where the photo was originally taken. Can you wow. see him? Can you see him? Oh shit! And now I can. Look at you! Look at you! Right there, eh? What are you bloody doing? Peeking- Like, where's his body? Why is it just a face? Like, where's the body here? And, like, the shoulder? Is that- It is that, right? Yeah. Die. It's hard to not notice this face peeking out from one of the pillars in the back. The staff states. Just imagine seeing a face like that in real life, just poking, like with no body. No body, just a face peeking out around a bloody, bloody pole. I'd, I'd, that would just fuck you up, wouldn't it? That would just mess you up. It's that this could be a spirit from the olden days that used to work in these old mines. What do you think? A strange light reflection, lens flare of some sorts, or a visitor from the afterlife? Could be a lens flare, but I don't know, man. That looks like a proper face. Church of Shadows. Now we want to take a look at an update from paranormal enthusiast Signs and Signals. In the past, they had traveled to an old home. Oh, fucking hell, you did it, didn't you? You did it. I just saw you in, the, in, my, in my peripheral. 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 Peripheria. I saw it in my peripheral onto church one night and they came across a really creepy looking shadow person peeking from shadow behind bastard. the corner oh god it's so it's so it's so so much it's so humanoid it's Almost so humanoid later, they venture out to the same church to see if whatever was visiting them that night still remains in there and it didn't take long until really weird things started to unfold See, I don't want to do this before. Now, we just need to stop coming back here, man. Come on. I'm good. Come on! Do it again! Poltergeist activity is a common sign for a strong otherworldly presence. Apparently, this church was also home to several rituals yeah, that's that right. people conducted in the do past. Do it again! Come on! A bit later, they captured this. We've seen you in here before. That's right. 
Uh huh. You know that you're in here. Yes. You know, we know that you're in here. You know that I know that I know that you know. <sighs> Fuck off with the sound, mate. The sound is creepier than the blocking image. The blocking? You know what I mean. So why are you here? Was this the infamous shadow from the past? Who knows? But it got even a little bit more creepy. Let's just go into the main area. Yeah, go see what... It always shows itself whenever we go in there. You heard the voice from, like, out here? It wasn't from back here. It, from... it sounded like it was from somewhere else in here. It wasn't, like, in the hall. Yeah, I think it's from the back right there. Uh, from the back, on the right corner. I don't know, that's what I'm saying. It's just from the one over there. That's what you don't care. Oh, my oh! God! Oh, my God! Oh. Fucking god, mate! Oh my god, mate! I'm, mate, if I heard, sh if I heard, like that's one of my worst fears, mate. Look at the state of this, okay? Let me just get a zoom in on that bastard. Look, zoom in, okay? If I heard footsteps like that running at me, mate, I think that'd be worse than seeing something, you know? Because your senses would go crazy. You'd hear it, you'd feel it. Excuse me, sorry. <laughs> you'd feel it. And then you would just shit yourself. God, oh my god. 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 <laughs> Mate, what is this channel? What is this channel? You said it at the beginning. After yeah. something was seemingly running at them, they come across this shadow just sitting there and watching them. Was it perhaps <laughs> playing tricks on them? It's very likely. I invite you to check their whole investigation out on signs and signals. Mirror thing. The following is a recording which was shared by user Cam. She was recording a fun dance tonight for her profile and had some of her family and friends over. All in all it was a really enjoyable evening. But one of her friends noticed that something seemed off with this video. Mate, that, that girl with the bloody helmet, she's preparing to get pissed right on. Don't worry if I get too drunk, I got a fucking crash helmet on. What? What am I seeing? What am I seeing? Oh! Oh shit, is that a face in the- It almost appears as if a creepy face can be seen in the mirror behind the woman. Oh, yeah! It does- Oh god! They stated god. that this was not a reflection of something else and that this normally isn't there. So- Oh fucking hell! Mate, that's a legit a face! Was it something from another realm? Or is it just pareidolia? I think, yeah, I think that is para... No, do At work! Robin Skurvin has shared the following really odd encounter that apparently was recorded by the CCTV camera right in front of their workplace. It also looked like something was manifesting out of thin air. Let's see, hang on, it's gonna pull up here in just a second. Okay, there it is, right there. Watch. Do it again. It goes all the way across the camera. Now that you know where it's at, I'll pull out a little bit. That's what she said. <laughs> you just watch this thing. It goes all the way across. And there's not a light because there is no light back there behind. You can see up on the hill back there, there's no light there. There's nobody over here, but it's still going across the camera. You can't see it as much now, Yeah. but it's there. So, what was Robin seeing that night? Was it merely a strange light that was transmitted from a car or an object on the back? I don't think it's anything paranormal. 
Or was something floating, oh. or possibly walking by here? I don't know. I, I, I can't... I can't see the perspective of it. It's like... It left them quite it a bit big? baffled, is it small? he said. All right. Was it Grandma? Now we check out another Reddit submission from user mgirl. The young woman suspects that the security camera in her grandma's bedroom, in which her little kid was having a sleepover one night, captured a spirit which was visiting her little son. She states, This was years ago and the camera wasn't high resolution and choppy and I was never sent the video by my aunt. She only shared this picture. Oh fuck it, I've seen this one. I've seen this one, mate. That woman in the back there, in the in the doorway, right? She's not there, ladies and gentlemen. She's not bloody there, mate. I you saying Ben, but I can see her. No! She's not there. My grandma had passed away a few months prior, and I believe That baby can clearly see her. She's he's like, oh, fuck it out! Oh my god, don't turn around! <laughs> Her spirit was comforting my son that night. You can see her as she looked around the time she passed, the varicose veins and her easily bruised lady skin, covered with bruises due to her blood thinner mats, her hair not done, and the same Moo Moo nightgown my grandma wore often. So could the young woman be right, and her son was visited by the spirit of her late grandma? So, d were they saying that they can see the, the the veins and the bruises on her skin, mate? What are you? What image are you looking at? That was freaky deaky. The peeker. This is a recording from user Short and Stout Guy, who on his channel is sharing quite a few paranormal investigations that can be described as quite intriguing. This night he had received a stationary CCTV recording from a client of his. He states, In this case the owners had reported a small child-sized entity that would, at times, pick out at them from around the corner down the hallway. Oh! The group had set is up it, its- Is that you there? Is that you? Space at the end of this hallway to the left. What? What's that there? If you watch the doorway at the end of the hall, the night vision camera is it? recorded what appears to be a dark shape that oh, forms sh and leans out. Oh, I think I've seen this. I think I've seen this one. To take a look down at the team and then pulls back in. Oh, I'm not having that, mate. I'm not having that shit. That's creepy as hell. That's creepy as hell. Oh, God. Is it an entity? The camera is not the best, which is why it's pretty hard really? to make out facial features. But it is undeniable that something was peeking out the doorway here. Yeah. Was it paranormal or something else? You decide. I don't know what that was, mate. That is freaky deaky. Poltergeist. Now we want to check out a new paranormal <laughs> clip which was shared by user Mellowbird. He had shared quite a number of crazy poltergeist events in the past years, and some people have mistakenly called him out for being a faker. However, they oftentimes don't realize that in the video where he was wearing a green suit, he was simply showing that it would be impossible for him to fake all of the crazy activity in his home. One of the most interesting encounters this year had unfolded in also oh, actually did a green suit to say look mate even with a green suit i can't do this shit man the storage part of his house take a good look oh shit oh shit what is that? What the hell am I looking at, mate? Is it a blur of something? I... Fuck it, guys. What? How? A shadow entity is clearly appearing from the right corner. Oh, God! Besides tons of other poltergeist activity that seems to be. Is that. 
Mate, I'm not being funny. Is that a tall ass long bastard shadow bastard right there? Is that one? It, is that slender bastard? Slender man. Is it? Or is it this thing they're talking about? Because if that's that thing, mate, look at the state of his arms. His fingers are down by his heels. Like, You're pretty common around his property. Oh, oh no! Okay. What? It's like it's floating up in the sky or something. Mate, it looks like that is the shadow. It, like with the head, the shoulders, the torso, the legs, and the long ass bloody arm there, mate. But what do you believe? I, I have know. no explanation at what we are looking at here exactly. Pretty I, eerie. It's it's more so that thing that I was telling you about than the actual blurry th stuff. Abandoned. This is an eerie investigation video, which was forwarded to me by Zodiac. The story goes that two friends were exploring a supposedly haunted building one day, which was visited by the ghost of a lady once in a while. Why, however, is not exactly known. Well, as they are walking through the ruins of this former place, the cameraman captures something on his device that shouldn't have been there, and he didn't realize it at first. I'm not having that shit! I'm not having that! Look at you! Huh? Look at you! Hey? You pretty little ghost thing! Look at you, pretty little ghost bitch! It's gone. Motherfucker, she's gone. She's gone. Oh my fucking god, man. All right, yeah, you're pretty. All right? You don't have to show off about it. F -f Freaking people out with your prettiness. Oh my god. I don't know now, actually. I don't know now because where's your neck? Where's your neck? Was it perhaps the spirit of the lady that was lingering and waiting for the two? Or oh, fucking hell, man. That's epic. That's epicness. This is just a spooky hoax. Oh, God. There you go, mate. That was King Frostmare. Bloody brilliant as always. King Frostmare, mate. You bloody legend. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you did like the video, give a little likey, mate. All right? And if you're new to the channel, subscribe. It's free. And I'll see you on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.